welcome back to the channel. Today, it is opening day on one of my favorite reservoirs of all time. Uh, I caught some giant, giant cut boat trout out of this lake last year and uh, we're hoping to repeat that success. So, getting to the trail a little late, about 8 a.m. and uh, it's kind of cold actually. It's only 34 degrees out here this morning, so that's a kind of okay that we're a little late and it's supposed to get overcast later on in the day. So water's still very cold, trout will still be active all throughout the day. It's not gonna be a problem. giant at this reservoir so I'm gonna get some uh, rods rigged up show you what I'm uh, gonna throw at them today and uh, see if we can't catch some giants all right here's our arsenal today we are going to be throwing a rainbow trout colored jerk bait and that could get a brown trout or a muskie there are muskies in here it'd be sick to get a muskie I did see a giant one last year about like 30 40 feet down kind of basically where I'm standing today because the <clears throat> reservoir is super low and then we're actually going to run a dead stick with a float and a little green jig with a plastic uh, power nymph on it. You can't fish with natural bait in this reservoir. So this is as close as I can get to natural bait is uh, by floating that thing. Um, especially there's a nice little breeze today. It's like a five mile an hour breeze. So that float is just gonna bounce. It's gonna jig for me. It's gonna work perfectly. And then the last thing, we're just going to be jigging a very tiny, again, 1 16th ounce jig with my Berkley Power Nymph. So, here we go. There we go. I thought there was one on there. Could not see. Could not see my bobber looked up. Bobber was down and we got a nice fish. Oh yeah. This is exactly what we were after. Real nice fish. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it took a while. Yes, no skunk today, no skunk. Look at that fish, sweet, so sweet. And he swallowed it, so I don't know if we're gonna be able to get this out and uh, release him. 
We're gonna try, I'm not keeping today. I honestly just did not feel like keeping fish today. Uh, so I'm gonna try to get them off, but uh, hilarious. <clears throat> Looked up, did not, could not see where my float was, my bobber. And uh, I was like, oh my God, it's gotta be. I could not reel my other run in fast enough <laughs> before this one was on there, so. I was really starting to, oh boy, he's strong. Really starting to actually think that we were gonna be uh, skunk today. No joke, but here we are. Got a nice rainbow and uh, we'll, we're gonna keep this one. There we go. Thought I felt something. Ooh, that one feels pretty good, actually. That one feels pretty solid. I haven't seen him yet, I haven't seen him yet. Oh yeah, that's a big one. That's a big one. <clears throat> that's a big brown. Ooh, solid fish. Biggest brown of the year, I think. Oh, he's not that big. He's just fighting like your typical brown, which is a monster fight. Sweet! Number two for the day. Number two. Right on. You know what? Since we're since we kept the first one, I think I will actually keep this one, and then that's our limit. And uh And I must spend the ticket switching to that green so they can see it, which is what I was suspecting based on. What's that? Green? Yeah, I just switched to uh, this other one to that to the green color, and sure enough, I just think they can't see right now. You know, it's so crappy the water. Sweet brown trout. He's probably I don't know, 15, 16 inches. But uh, that's number two for the day. So we got our limit at this reservoir and uh, we'll get them on the stringer, see if we can't get a couple more. All right, well, we ended up calling it for the day. Ended up with uh, two really nice fish. One 15 inch brown, as you saw, and one 17 inch rainbow. Ended up actually keeping them for our daily limit here. Not bad for an opening day. So if you like this episode, please leave me a comment, subscribe, and I will see you next adventure.